Uh, hello, everyone. Uh, thanks uh, to the organizers uh, for uh, inviting us. And uh, do we have the image? Okay, yeah, thank you very much. So I'm alone uh, because of unexpected changes. My colleague could not come. And I'm presenting a hybrid between a basic research project and the practice of art collecting ex exhibition making in a National Museum for Contemporary Art. I'm going to talk about two pilot studies conducted in 2022 that aims to provide a foundation to develop a model for preserving and archiving new media artwork. Can you uh, move to the next slide? Okay. In 2021, the Museum of Modern Art launched the New Media Lab and it provided support for the acquisition process, the yearly purchases for the national uh, collection for the artist as well as the museum, namely, the works were first exhibited in the gallery before being added to the collection. Uh, the Nation Culture Project uh, that Nick Art Pioneer Ruk Josic created in 2000 was based on a then widely used internet portal in Slovenia, the Mat Pura directory, and it used Macromedia Flash platform. 22 years later, there are several dilemmas. A now long gone search engine, in fact, a Yahoo type directory, has to be substituted without losing the layers of cultural meaning that originally related the internet context to the artistic con uh, context and to the uh, technologically generated text. Uh, the author's reconstruction of the project retains the initial idea to read the, the title as nation minus culture. In 2000, the lack of cultural sophistication was obvious and in a funny way in the queries for pornography. In 2022, however, the target of critical reflection was hate speech as practiced on Twitter. Chosic's idea of bridging 22 years of technological development by migrating a work originally conceived for a digital born Slovenian text generator to Twitter. So this suggests the extent uh, that the, to, to which the creative act needs to be repeated with restoration and hence how challenging such work is to uh, archive. Also, this particular project points to the implied necessity for this project to include cutting edge technological development that in both cases is tied to the Slovenian language context. Namely, the reconstruction included the development of one of the currently most sophisticated large language models, generative pretrained trained transformer GPT-2 for the Slovene language. Uh, this last fact, at the first glance contradicts the author's explicit intention to emphasize the glitches, the errors, carnivalesque chaos in the version from uh, 2000. And now could we she see the uh, video, please? <laughs> so now I will present uh, the second uh, uh, pilot uh, project. So uh, we So, there's no the new media artworks by the Slovenian artist Srećo Dragan were originally developed in collaboration with uh, research laboratories and used cutting edge programs. A digital communities installation uh, that used text messages on mobile phones and included uh, techno performance based on gate recognition from 2005 five, was recreated. And it was recreated using contemporary computer vision algorithms based on neural networks. The project consists of three rooms. In the first room, one, uh, the, in the, the room one, the visitor uh, is faced with her learned modes of movement. The individual styles of walking are as conceived in this project, not learned and therefore uh, not tied to society's codes and prejudices. So basically gate recognition uh, recognizes the characteristics of 
characteristics of individual walks. The algorithmic matchmaking in the third room is non-discriminatory. Beyond the matrix, there is the openness of the coincidental. The two persons receive the text messages to meet in a coffee shop. So to conclude, the two pilot projects are being uh, the foundation for the development of guidelines for a long-term, that is to say, a sustainable digital presentation of uh, new media art. And uh, this is uh, the video that you are watching is actually it was realized uh, by, of course, also uh, in collaboration with the University of Ljubljana by the student, but it is meant to actually show the uh, artistic uh, concept and facilitate uh, also its later uh, reconstruction. So, yeah, thank you very much.